not distance bucking. Uh, distance bucking? What for? Because Cousin Brayburn and the rest of the Apple family in Appaloosa seem to think that their team can beat Ponyville at Buckball. What? <laughs> That's ridiculous! No pony beats Ponyville! I mean, I could beat the whole town of Appaloosa at Buckball with one wing tied behind my back! <laughs> So I can count on you to join the Ponyville Buckball team? Oh, yeah, I am so there. I've just got one question. Hmm? Uh, what's Buckball? Uh. My little pony, my little pony. Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete to have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends? So basically, Buckball is the coolest game ever. Offense, defense, teamwork, non-stop action, it's got it all! Well, Rainbow Dash, you sure seem to know a lot about this game. I've never even heard of Buckball. Yeah, I'm kind of an expert. <laughs> an expert who hadn't heard of the game either until I told you. Well, it's a new game. I probably know more than most ponies, so that makes me an expert. I don't know anything about it at all, but it sounds like there's a ball and Bucky, so I'm betting it's super duper fun! The point is, my cousin Brayburn somehow convinced a Pegasus and a unicorn to come play with him on the Appaloosa team. And he can't stop bragging about how his team is gonna beat ours. But, um, we don't have a team. Well, between Applejack and me, we've got two-thirds of a team. All we need is a unicorn. That's where you two come in. Uh, they know we're not unicorns, right? Uh, obviously. You're gonna be on my team, and Fluttershy is gonna be on Applejack's team. We'll play against each other, along with whatever unicorns want to try out, until we find the best one. Oh! Phew! That's a relief, because I left my unicorn costume at home. I know a lot of you are here because I told you what an amazing game Buckball is. And even though it's already an Apple family favorite, most of you probably don't know anything about it. So I thought we'd give you a quick demonstration. The two Earth Ponies are on offense. They meet in the middle of the field for the buck off. They both try to be the first one to kick it. And the Pegasus is on defense. She tries to keep the ball from going in the goal and passes it back to the Earth Pony on her team. Just give it a little kick, Pinky. <laughs> oh, I get it. And all the unicorns have to do is float these here baskets around the outside of the field and catch as many balls as possible for their team. You two get the idea? Absolutely! Oh, I don't know. That ball moves pretty fast. All right. Now let's see which of you has what it takes. Um, what do I do? When the ball comes towards you, catch it. Okay, just try your best, Pinky. I have been doing this a lot longer than you. <laughs> nice kick. <laughs> Great save, Flutterjack. <gasps> Coming your way, Pinky. <laughs> hey, this game is easy. <laughs> it actually is kind of fun. Where did Pinky Pie learn to buck like that? And Fluttershy's spinning tail catch is pretty amazing. Um, okay. Well, 
Let's see what the rest of you can do. Now, don't expect to be able to beat me twice in a row. Well, hello there, Mr. Ball. Hurry along, butterflies, before that ball comes and hits you. Nope. Um, okay. Let's see what the rest of you can do. Nope. Definitely not. No. Not a chance. No. Nope. And... No. Uh, this didn't go how I thought it would. <laughs> it sure didn't. This game is a whole lot more fun than I thought it would be. It's exactly as much fun as I thought it would be. A whole bunch! Carrying my water, my water, my water. Carrying my water on my shoulder pole. Hmm? Amazing! You should be more careful with these. You could lose them. Hey, snails, can you float one of those baskets over here? Hmm, sure. What do you want me to do with it? Catch! Anything else? Wow, Snails, you're a natural at buckball. It's a good thing, too. We were running out of unicorns. Do you think you'll be ready to play with Applejack and Rainbow Dash against the Appaloosa team? I guess I'll find out. Plus, after I deliver this water, I don't really have anything else to do. Well, Snails, with you on the team, Ponyville is one step closer to crushing Appaloosa. <laughs> and after today, it's pretty clear who the other two players should be. What do you mean? I thought you and Dash were gonna play. Yeah! If you're not crushing Appaloosa, who is? <laughs> uh, you two, obviously. Um, you want us to play buckball against Appaloosa instead of you? Mm-hmm. Unbelievable and incredible. Come on! I can't explain it, but you two are really good at this game. And if it means beating Appaloosa, I'll give either one of you my spot on the team quicker than Granny Smith can core an apple. Me too! I'd normally be so pumped all of Ponyville was counting on me to win, I'd run right over the competition. But you still flew rings around me. Oh, I'm sorry. I was just having fun. Well, you can have all the fun you want, as long as it's while you're beating the hide off of Braeburn's team. I do like fun! Honestly, the game was a little scary at first, but once I got the hang of it, I had a pretty good time. Let's get this party started! All right, but if we really want to beat Appaloosa, we're gonna have to get serious. Serious? With serious practice. Uh, wow, this looks pretty intense. Well, duh. You two are going to be representing all of Ponyville. And more importantly, us. That's why, before we leave for Appaloosa tomorrow, you two are going to practice just as hard as we would. So let's hop to it. Snails already has a head start on you. Okay, if you want to win, you totally got to get this drill down. I, I, I do?
to buck a ball into a goal from any direction is the most important thing in the game. If you say so. Just one miss will ruin the Apple family's buck ball reputation forever! to those two. I don't know. They mopped the field with us before. All right. That's it for today, y'all. Phew. I thought practice was supposed to make us better. Maybe we just need a little rest. Or a whole lot of it. Just be sure to get your heads in the game before tomorrow. All of Ponyville is counting on a win. I really don't want to let Applejack and Rainbow Dash down or any pony else, but after that practice, I'm not feeling very confident. Maybe we weren't that bad. Hmm. I guess I was hoping you saw something I didn't. I know our friends want us to win, but how can the whole town be counting on us if most ponies have never even heard of Buckball? I know! How can we disappoint a pony who doesn't even know we have a team? Or that we're gonna play Appaloosa. Yeah, I don't think we need to worry. I'd be surprised if any pony in this town cares about this game at all. Go, Go Pony! Go, Go Pony! Go! Win! 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 <laughs> Whoa, the whole town really seems to care about this game a lot. <gasps> Team a little. Yep. We wanted to make sure you two knew that all of Ponyville was behind you. Great. I hear the whole town's already planning a parade for when you get back after whooping Appaloosa. That should feel pretty good. It should. Totally. Just spend the whole ride to Appaloosa thinking about every pony cheering for the victorious Ponyville Buckball team. I bet Princess Celestia even comes to congratulate you. If that doesn't get you in the zone, I don't know what will. I don't know what zone Rainbow Dash is talking about, but I'm pretty sure I don't want to be in it. Do you? Hey! You two are supposed to be in the zone! You see? The thing is... Thinking about every pony? Thinking about us? Yeah, there's just no way to... There's no way that we can get in the zone because the zone sounds like a horrible place since we are terrible at buckball and we are going to lose and let every pony down and we don't want to play anymore! <laughs> I'm still okay with playing in case you were worried. I don't get it. They're naturals. Why wouldn't they want to play anymore? Maybe us telling them how much every pony was counting on them messed them up somehow. What? That's crazy talk. Having ponies depend on you is exactly what you need to focus. Get and serious and play hard and... Get ready to totally smash the competition and... And... None of that sounds like Pinky or Fluttershy, does it? <sighs> Guess not. 
We got so wrapped up in what's important to us, we went and ruined what was fun about the game for them. Mm. What do we do now? Pinky? Fluttershy? We know you're in here. Well, we've looked in every other car on the train. Maybe you need to look again. Yeah, because we're totally not in here. And we're definitely not in here if you're going to try and make us play against that blue star. Or any pony else. <clears throat> oh, we're sorry to let you down. But it's better to do it now than join the game against Appaloosa. You don't have to play against Appaloosa. We don't? Nope. We're gonna take your place. So you don't have to worry about that at all. Oh, why didn't you say so? But we can't take on Brayburn and his team without any practice. So we need you to play just one more time. Against us. Now, I know we mixed up the teams before, but since Dash and I really need the practice, we'll play against the two of you. Oh, I don't know how much practice you'll get against us. We've been playing just awful. Don't worry about it. Applejack and I just need a little workout. Yep, you two just do your best. I can do that. You really do need practice. We can keep going. Yeah, I could do this all day. <sighs> no thanks. Playing against you two is just as humiliating now as it was when we weren't trying to show you how awesome you are. Wait, what? Finally! You must have noticed how you aren't bad anymore. Oh, yeah. Weird. But, um,. Why were we so terrible before? I guess some ponies thrive on pressure, and some ponies don't. And even though we weren't playing, we were treating you like us, which totally stressed you out. And that just sucked the fun right out of the game for you. And having fun is what makes you really, really, really good! But being good doesn't matter if we're too afraid of letting ponies down. I'm sure folks want you to win, but not if worrying about it makes you miserable. Winning's never worth that. But how do we keep from worrying about it? You could do what I do and not think about it. Seriously, I don't think about anything. Ever. Hmm. Works for me! Pegasus. Oh, I don't know if we can win. You know what I would do? Not think about it? Not think of... Oh, yeah, that. <laughs> and as long as you're having fun, it doesn't matter if you win or not. Lots 
of tense back and forth here. Fluttershy unleashes her patented spin move, but Kramer's there to... No! It's Pinky with a somersault kick! Looks like you three made quite an impression. Well, cousin, I have to admit, your Ponyville team played a pretty good game. <laughs> good game? We bucked the hooves right off of you. Yep, you sure as shooting did. I'm gonna have to get real serious about a strategy for our rematch. Oh, I wouldn't get too serious. Yeah, every pony knows the secret to good buck ball is just having fun. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> 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 <laughs>